What is this? Why are we babysitting for <laughs> Igor? Dude, he just wanted the, the velvet room to himself for a while. It's bigger than the inmate's entire than the inmate's entire <laughs> inmate's stomach. Inmate's entire stomach. <laughs> the inmate's entire stomach, mate. Welcome back to Rat Attack. Hey guys. <laughs> We're uh, playing Persona, I guess. So. <laughs> Playing Persona, guys. I hope you like. Oh, oh my God! We better just got ride. done reading the Bible. Yeah, <laughs> Jesus was really cool in it. I like the plot twist. What should we do now? I don't know. Um, ch -ch 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 -ch. don't we have friends, Kichi Joji? We just gotta waste some time, I guess. So why don't we? Let's watch our movie. We'll do that at night. Or wait, okay. How about we watch the movie now and then we go to Kichi Joji at night? Okay. That sounds like a plan to me. I still don't know the buttons after 50 flipping hours of this game. It is sad to watch. Thank you. I'm so glad everyone's depressed watching this. Yeah, it is. <laughs> oh, it's raining. That's it's cool. Cute. I feel like... Or we could go to Mementos. Up to you. Okay, I say we go to Why don't... Mementos. Do some of those... Well, hold on, hold on, hold on. Because we have one target right now, which is that girl, right? We, have, we like, still we need to find targets. the name for the Kichi Joji guy. Look at our targets. Oh, how do I do that? I don't know. Uh, requests. requests. Okay. See, we ID'd two of these people. Well, why don't we just get the guy and then do Kich or mementos tomorrow? Okay. Uh, Mishima told you about an old man causing trouble. Ask around for info on Kichi Joji at night. See, so we wanted to go there at night anyways. Okay, that's a good plan. I like that. Thank you. Want to go home already? Oh, it makes you wait until evening. What? How about... Oh, because Sojiro doesn't want us there. Oh. Let's... Well, that oh, just that throws nice. all our plans off. <laughs> you can do batting. Sure. Plus, I think you can get prizes during the day. Oh, yeah. Welcome. Enjoy your time here. Oh, that's right. You got a free play ticket. Are you going to use it? Yes, sir. Yes. So you're using a free play ticket? Then you don't have to pay this time. Intermediate. Yeah, we're good. Looks like you've already won the home run prize already. Good luck in trying for the slugger prize as well. All right. All right. Where's the ball? Oh, oh there's one. <laughs> Dang it. Don't do bad. Oh, you did bad. What? What are we? What am I supposed to do? This is a luck-based game. Yeah, home run it. True. I'm sure there's a way to do it, right? Come on! Oh. Come on! It hit it! It, 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 it That counts. No! Oh. Hey, hey! This is so sad. You didn't win the home run or slugger prize. Better luck next time. Oh. Uh, wait. Ho hold on. Like. So what do you need to do to get the slugger prize? Just hit all of them? Or at least more than one. Okay, let's try and hit all of them. <laughs> okay. If you think you can. I mean, I hit four out of five last time, so I only need to do a little bit better. No, I think it means home run more than one. Okay. Uh... <sighs> See? Oh, my God. Oh. oh! Okay, maybe you do need to just hit them all. <laughs> we'll try it. No, what? Oh. what? Why is the target so small? It's a home run either. Gage! Hey. You suck. You didn't win a home run. <laughs> <laughs> Gage is like <coughs> melted into his chair right now. I'm so sorry, guys. I'm so sorry I made you watch another game. I'm going to waste all <laughs> our money. <laughs> okay, this time for sure. Mm hmm. Controller sweaty AF. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, I got the timing down perfectly now. Okay. Almost perfectly. Nice. Calculating. Oh my god. I almost hit it too early. Okay. Okay, I hit all of them. You hit all of them. Okay. Give me a slugger prize. Here you go. Oh, you didn't miss a single shot. Well done. I'll give you this. Okay, so that is what it is. Okay. Harder core S. Admirable swinging, as usual. But you can only win the home run prize once. Probably stop for today. Nice Got a really good swing. Okay. Well, it only cost us sixteen hundred dollars. <laughs> Yen, much different than dollars. <laughs> I'm assuming we send in for maintenance. We'll be at. Uh, yeah, July. 
<laughs> good to know, good to know. I'm just giving up on the voices at this point. Hey. Cheeky Joji. Kichi Joji. You haven't heard anything from the student council president, have you? She was stalk us the other day. Miss Honest <laughs> student must be busy kissing butt somewhere. <laughs> you don't have to be so harsh. What is this about a student council president? <laughs> Yusuke is just like, what are you talking about, guys? <laughs> <laughs> I like to imagine Yusuke takes Ryuji's side and just says, yeah, I bet she is kissing butt somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> It'd be so out of character. I feel like Yusuke does not like Ryuji that much. Uh, he'll, th they'll grow to be besties. I hope so. The one at our school has kind of been keeping tabs on us. I think she's suspicious of us. Are you sure it is not merely a result of Ryuji's general <laughs> misconduct? Shut up! Though, to be honest, the three of you most certainly stand out. Do try to be careful. I cannot be there to look over you at school, you know. That duty rests on your broad shoulders, Ethage. Broad? Now they're kind of like narrow as toothpicks, but... Is he flirting with us? <laughs> Got it. I'll make sure to keep an eye on Ryuji, too. I can totally see Yusuke being, like, the dad of the group or something, you know? <laughs> Why you gotta single me out? The others kind of overshadow you sometimes, but don't forget, you're famous too. What? No, they don't. Yeah, that's not true. <laughs> Just make sure you're careful, okay? I dodged a eraser in class or something. Hey, inmate. <laughs> you, what? Can't, what, you can't Where'd do this? Where'd you get my phone number? <laughs> inmate, we need to talk to you. Get over here right now. Caroline, this is not a sufficient explanation. How'd you, do you do you guys have phones? What is this? I just like to imagine they're like on Twitter just posting like <laughs> <laughs> stupid memes. Well. Inmate, come to the entrance of the velvet room before we change our minds. That's the door only we can see in your world. You'd better not go out to the wrong place. Then. We will be waiting for you. We expect great haste and enthusiasm from you. Why can't you just summon me when I'm asleep? Yeah, You've right? done that a we're about to go times. to bed right now. Why you gotta waste my night? Hey, who are you talking to? They sounded really noisy. If you're being summoned somewhere, you should probably get going. Uh, we should probably do that if they want us to go. I guess so. Kind of ruins our plans, but whatever. Maybe it won't take all night. It'll take all night. Yeah, it'll take all night. <laughs> <laughs> all right, they're over here. Yeah. Was the velvet room an option to fast travel to? Shut up. This is I'm, faster. I'm just asking. This is I'm not judging. <laughs> so you've come, inmate. Didn't sound like I had a choice. Yeah. You're late. Next time we expect you in front of us within two seconds of our calling. We've got some new duties lined up for you. I got my own stuff going on, guys. Yeah. <laughs> Let's call them special assignments. To the point, there are a number of places in your reality society that may foster your rehabilitation. Okay, like darts? You will provide the value of these places to us, in person. Listen up, inmate. We will select various locations that we suspect could be vital to your rehabilitation. Should you recognize a place that we mentioned, then you are to escort us there. <laughs> Trying to get out of here? Want to go explore? What? <laughs> Are those ears of yours just for decoration? I thought that was the mean one for a second because <laughs> of what she said. These are special assignments for the sake of your rehabilitation. Work just as hard at them as you do the rest of your duties. We will await you in front of the door, like this, whenever a special assignment is available. Wait, are they actually going to come with us? I guess and, so. Like, hang out? Wait, does that mean they're physical people? I'm not their babysitter here. <laughs> Should you meet our expectations, we'll scrape together some sort of reward for you, so no slacking off. We ought to mention, these special assignments will not be available indefinitely. Oh god. To phrase it for your compensation, you will have Compren until the- Comprehension. Okay, whatever. <laughs> what did I say? Compensation. Oh. You will have it until the end of the year to complete them. That sure seems like a long time. Isn't that the rest of the game? Yeah. Huh? You are also required to continue working towards your rehabilitation to earn these assignments. We're really going out of our way for you here. Don't tell us we never did anything special for you. Outings with the twins! Okay, <laughs> let's go hang out, guys! You can now take the twins to various facilities that pique their interest. When these outings are available, the duo can be found waiting for Eth that's just outside the Velvet Room. In order to take them to these locations, you'll need to check out the various facilities around the city. Time will pass during an outing with the twins. 
That concludes our explanation. Could you have told me that over the phone? Yeah. In that case. We will now introduce the first special assignment. Are you prepared? I mean, why don't I go bully? <laughs> <laughs> I'm prepared. Okay. Very well. Then listen closely. The first location we have chosen is... What's going through Morgana's mind right now? Who's he talking to? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. One that has grown quite popular lately. It's purpose pur to offer foods that simulate the feeling of being in space. Purported? Yeah. What the heck? The food is apparently massive enough to rival the size of the universe itself and resembles a mysterious spacecraft. If this food exemplifies both the unknown and the vast nothingness of space, it is sure to stimulate the heart. They you guys just have a lot of fancy words for saying you want to go eat a burger. Yeah, seriously. <laughs> Does its description bring any locations to mind? Big Bang Burger? Right? Well, if you know where it is, then escort us there immediately. <laughs> it could be the Big Bang Burger over in Shibuya. What'll you do? So, what'll it be? <laughs> you mean Big Bang Burger? <laughs> you mean Big Bang Burger? Oh. Big Bang Burger? The name is fitting, I suppose. We shall confirm our intel for ourselves. Lead the way. Hey, no offense. Can you turn like dress into something else if we're gonna go get burgers? Offense. Hmm. We look like such a pervert right now. <laughs> yeah, I know, I know. <laughs> Bringing two cosplayed twins into a burger shop. Uh. Well, it is indeed shaped like a mysterious craft, but it's much smaller than I had expected. <laughs> What is this? Why are we babysitting for <laughs> Igor? Dude, he just wanted the, the velvet room to himself for a while. It'd be so funny if Igor called us like, Hey, thanks for babysitting those two. Like, <laughs> Your rehabilitation is going well. Here's 20 bucks for the babysitting. <laughs> I, I love that this isn't the game, though. It's just weird. What is do it... people think that we're just taking to like cosplaying children? I didn't realize they were physical. I though. wonder if people can even see them. I don't know. Is this the meal they boasted to be as immense as the cosmos? I'm quite disappointed. Hey, inmate, you don't really expect some kind of reward out of this, do you? Uh... It's the Big Bang Challenge, tell her that. It's the Big Bang Challenge. So, humanity intends to generate its own universes now, does it? You've got guts. <laughs> We've had enough of your smart remarks. Know your place, inmate. Oh, so they can get that large? <laughs> the Big Bang Challenge. What an intriguing <laughs> concept. What the heck is Why don't we take on? these two gremlin children uh, to burger <laughs> place? Uh, well, I guess we have daughters now. <laughs> yeah, apparently. <laughs> For the sake of your rehabilitation, you are to take this challenge. I've already done it. It's your turn. Yeah. I'd like to see you try it. Of course, you will take the largest they offer. I'm, I'm only a uh, second mate right now, guys. Yeah. Any objections, inmate? Uh, I'm, I'm not, not ranked high enough. Not ranked high enough yet. Ah, uh, yes. I did overhear that the challenge required advancement through a number of previous stages. Quit spacing out. I don't care. You're taking that challenge one way or another. Get on your knees and beg if you have to. Might as well give it a shot. <laughs> That's the final one. What the heck? Yeah. Wow. Thank you for waiting. Don't tell me. You're really doing this? Not only that, but you are ten thousandth customer. What? To show appreciation, we're we're treating you with the highest tier of the Big Bang Challenge, the Cosmic Tower Burger. Well, thank God I don't have to pay for it. Yeah. <laughs> That is not even a burger anymore. Yeah, that's just diabetes in a stack. That thing smells to look at. Yeah. Wow! Lucky you! Well then, it's time to get the 30 minute Big Bang Challenge started. Ready? Begin! Girls, can you, can you help me with this? <laughs> the last burger was downright insignificant by comparison. It's bigger than the inmate's entire than the inmate's entire <laughs> inmate's stomach. Inmate's entire stomach. <laughs> the inmate's entire stomach, <laughs> mate. <laughs> Perhaps the moniker implies that any di diner. Ugh, I cannot read. <sighs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> you sound so mad, like so genuinely frustrated. <sighs> it's kept happening. <laughs> I feel that it's happened to me too. 
Perhaps a moniker implies that any diner's stomach will suffer its own big bang? Uh, this is going to be easy. <laughs> Ask if they want to try it. Would you care to try it? This is your rehabilitation, not ours. C can you tell me how this helps rehabilitate me in any form? Yeah. That's right. We are here only to observe you, and don't forget it. I predict this challenge shall be a fairly difficult one. Um, yeah. Be that as it may, you must finish the food tower in its entirety. Failing to join the Clean Plate Club is a grave offense. Okay. Do you think it's a good idea to add even more crimes to your record? Get to the rehabilitating inmate. <laughs> well, how do you even pick that up? <laughs> <laughs> Not a bad start. But you've only just begun. I'm already full. <laughs> oh, great. <laughs> You're stopping? Who said you could stop? No breaks! Work that jaw! <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> These kids are intimidating, man! My stomach's gonna burst. Hmm? Don't his eyes look rather dead to you? Perhaps he is glimpsing the vast emptiness of outer space. Um, hey, is he really alright? He's not about to keel over, is he? <laughs> Igor's gonna be like, did you kill them? <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I can finish. I think he's about to pass out. I suppose. It appears this truly was too much for him to handle. Very well, let us pitch in. <laughs> yeah, uh... Hey. You're hopeless, inmate. You'd better be grateful that we're bailing you out of this. Phew, we did it. I have to say, you really held your own there. You almost didn't make it through, but we'll call this a success since your stomach didn't burst. Oh, it will. Give me five minutes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I must say, though, I'm rather dissatisfied with this place's usage of the moniker Big Bang Burger. They certainly craft a meal of impressive size, but when compared to the, what the Big Bang generated, it's not grand in the least. What'd you expect, dude? <laughs> Did, did you expect a human diner to make a, something equivalent to the Big Bang? <laughs> yeah, it's not really something we can do. Do humans have some sort of compulsion for exaggerating the sizes of things? Yes, actually. Good question. In fact, this challenge raises quite a few of them. You took the challenge for the sake of your rehabilitation, but who with the right mind would willingly consume so much food? Maybe I don't understand humanity at all. Say, inmate, why are humans always testing and pushing their limits? Okay, what do we think they'd like? Does, does this gonna... I guess we have a relationship with them, huh? Yeah. Um, Maybe... Sort of training? Probably? Yeah, they, they, I think they're looking for rational reasons here. Okay. They do it as a sort of training. <laughs> I guess not. <laughs> Aren't there more practical approaches to training than such behavior? Hey, Justine, maybe we should take the challenge ourselves. I just had the very same thought. If we were to thrust ourselves into this ordeal, perhaps we would discover some answers. Hey, person! Uh, how can I help you? Oh my god, so they are just like... Here. Yeah. We're taking the Big Bang Challenge. Well, uh, there's a minimum age requirement to be eligible for the challenge. <laughs> Oh, could I interest you in our little bang meal instead? It even comes with a toy. Don't you want a cute little spaceship? A spaceship? That's a burger, fries, and juice for 500 yen. It'll be right up. Wait, we didn't ask for... It's too late now. <laughs> Let's just settle for that today. I admit I'm intrigued by the diminutive spaceship. <laughs> Yeah, don't tell me I have to foot the bell bill for you too. We do. Well, we didn't experience any of the wonders of space, but at least the taste was passable. You seemed much more excited by the toy than the taste anyway. <laughs> Shut up! I saw you eating around those pickle things or whatever they are, Justine. That that wasn't food from this earth. It was clearly a alien spawn of some sort. <laughs> what? Is this true? Uh, they're a delicacy. I see. Well, 
they didn't taste bad. <laughs> all right. But seriously, what are they? I ate all of mine, you know. Calm down, Caroline. We're getting off track. Well, <laughs> my God, I can't take these too seriously. No. Capable of conveying the majesty of space. While the toy spaceship helped to soften the blow, there's no denying the truth. <laughs> now we will formally acknowledge the completion of your task. So what's my reward? Yeah. Here is your reward. And give me the guts for that burger you made me eat. <laughs> right? <laughs> oh, yay. Oh, okay. Okay. You better work just as hard next time. We know about all sorts of locations that would aid your rehabilitation. <laughs> Alrighty then. I'm still taken aback by the truth. Your world is absolutely full of these shop places. Well, you guys literally live in a prison, so... Yeah, I imagine you haven't really seen the most of things. <laughs> For a reasonable fee, nearly every desire can be fulfilled. All as if it were nothing. It's usually not reasonable. <laughs> <laughs> well, still, it's pretty crazy if you think about it. Yeah. That does sound interesting. I believe it may merit further research. Anyways... Good work, inmate. Your final task for the day is to escort us back to the velvet room. Let's move. <laughs> well, All right. I escorted the twins back to the velvet room as ordered. Give us a heads up next time, Igor. Jeez. <laughs> what the heck? The Phantom Thieves usually make an effort to announce themselves. You're in high school, right? I know a good part-time job. They still haven't caught whoever sent that calling card. I'm actually a phantom thief. Wanna go grab some coffee? What, watch you like see who it is and just Ryuji. <laughs> yeah, <it laughs> just totally like, what totally are you doing, Ryuji? <laughs> did some idiot leak pictures again? Hmm. Man, that was a. Uh, I feel like I just babysat two kids for, for a couple hours. <laughs> yeah, that was. We got uh, some hot. abilities to make people cold. And what's the other one, Miragi? So, I think it's fire. Maybe. Oh, okay. Are we there yet? It's hard to breathe in here. Now for today's train news, today's headlines are... Calling card at Madarame exhibit? The police are evaluating whether or not this is a true threat or a prank. Scam outbreak in Shibuya. Students are the primary victims. Organized crime is suspected here. Hey, hey. Students getting scammed? That's scary. You should be careful when you go to Shibuya. Ba, ba. I feel like it'd be kind of easy to avoid scams. S scammers are dumb. But also smart. They're smart because they target dumb people. <laughs> a request to the student body. It says they're looking for information. I heard Principal Kobayakawa put it up. Information on the Phantom Thieves? Probably. Please consult the student council president if you have any details. Hmm. So we can go to her for anything? Why the student council president, though? What does she have to do with Principal Kobayakawa? I mean, Suspicious. Is his favorite. Maybe that's why he asked her to do it. Hmm. <laughs> yes, yes. How tragic. It seems like most... Oh, is this you? Uh, it doesn't matter. Ah, uh, who cares? <laughs> I thought it was me, though, but uh, who cares? It seems like most of society was surprised what that artist did. He was someone who represented Japan. They probably trusted him based on his name alone. Indeed, we are easily manipulated by the names we see. However, this world is filled with fake names. For instance, this creature, which you know well. It's called the Red King Crab, but it has a form that a crab should not have. A lobster. Ratakun, look at this picture. <laughs> Why me? Oh god. Give it oh. a try. The Red King Crab is biologically related to the Hermit Crab. So how is it different from a crab? Do Ooh, you know? We can get this. Oh, the pincers. Crabs always have a big one and a small one, but he has equal size. Like the claws? Yeah. Hmm. Pincer shape. That's where my money's at. Provides number of legs. Well, how Tr many legs are there? One, two, three, That's it. Uh, crabs think, always have six legs. Yeah, I think they always have six. And eyes. I mean... It's always two eyes. The face does look a little different. It does. But I think it's the pincers. Do they always have a big one and a small one? That's how I've always seen it. <laughs> That's how I've seen it in cartoons. I, okay. I used to watch the uh, Brave Wilderness guy, Coyote Peterson. Let's try it. The pincer's shape. Hmm. That 
That's a shame. <laughs> Man, this is stupid. You suck balls at my class, Joker. I suck balls at all the classes. <laughs> it's... Sorry. They are different from crabs in the number of legs that they have. What? I counted them. What? No. You're <laughs> wrong, actually. <laughs> crabs have five pairs of legs, but red king crabs only have four pairs. The direction the legs unfold is reversed too. Typically they face forward, but a red kings do not. Weird. I just thought crabs had like six legs and then two front ones. Yeah. I, I had, wouldn't get it right. I had good justification too. Yeah, I mean, he's... Crap, he's just looking at us. <laughs> Bummer. Incidentally, the tomali of a crab isn't its brain, as some people say. It's actually the crab's liver and pancreas. As you can see, the world is full of deception. How deceptive. I saw some kind of paste like that in the fridge at LeBlanc. But it's not often you see real crab meat. Hey, why don't we get sushi for our next celebration? Um, I used to really hate sushi when you made me try it the first time. Why? I don't... It was good. You don't need a reason to hate a food. Well, I don't need a reason to hate a you person. You didn't even let me finish. I was going to say, but I tried some other sushi not that long ago, and it wasn't actually horrible. But you still don't like it. It was actually moderately enjoyable. See, that's not how you describe something you like. It was mid. Okay, then just say it's mid. That doesn't mean you like it. It was better than hating it. <laughs> yeah. Well, wh why? what's your point? What are you trying to prove here? I'm not making it. I'm just saying, <laughs> if... You're saying, I moderately enjoyed it. That doesn't mean you like it. That sounds like... I mean, you literally said it's mid. That doesn't mean you like it. That I didn't doesn't say mean I you liked hate it. I know. So what are you arguing? <laughs> I'm not arguing at all. You're just picking something and running with it. <laughs> all I said is that I moderately enjoyed Our it. Our name did I... spread a bit, thanks to Moderame. <laughs> but I bet people still wouldn't care if we came out and said we're the Phantom Thieves. Hmm. Let's try it. <laughs> Please don't. That may seem like a fun idea for now. But what good would come of telling people our identities? Maybe they'd at least start treating us with some respect. <laughs> no, I was joking. Yeah. Well, I can see how you... Ugh, I can understand why you feel that way. That's just how things are now, but if we keep doing stuff like this, they'll definitely change. We simply need to devote ourselves to the cause. Our praise will come later. What he said. I'm sure some people out there will understand. Ugh, I guess we just gotta act like our modest heroes for now. <laughs> Ryuji wants to be famous. What? Why was Kawakami there? Which one's Kawakami? The teacher, the maid teacher. <laughs> oh. It was know. the one guy there, and then when we put our phone away, Kawakami was just standing there. Different class, man. I don't think so. She's cute, and I hear she's practicing hard. Shall I tell Miss President? It's so unfair she gets special treatment. Well, it doesn't really concern me. Student Council? What's going on? I wish I were an honor student. I don't want to have to pay tuition. <laughs> and study more dingus. Ta ha! Blah 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 blah. Blah 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 blah. blah, blah. President, what is the meaning of that posting? Principal Kobayakawa put that up without my. We've already received some anonymous information. I heard some students are getting threatened. I'm so scared. Please do something. What? They have dirt on me and they're demanding money? I can't go to the police? What should I do? What the heck? <laughs> Poor Makoto. <laughs> yeah, what is this? <laughs> Isn't this talking about the crimes that have been rumored to be occurring in Shibuya? So there are even victims at our school. What should we do? This is not something you make students deal with. Mm -hmm. This is frightening for us too. Principal Kobayakawa called you in yesterday, right? Did he tell you anything about this? No. Well, no. He's out today, but I will ask him tomorrow. Please wait on this for the time being. If you say so. My apologies for the confusion. Yikes. Don't worry. I'll do something about all of this. I will shoot the president. 
sure she'll get a gun eventually. Or the principal, not the president. <laughs> right. Hey, tomato, tomato, what are you going to do, right? Oops, friendly fire. <laughs> <laughs> if we keep this up, I'm sure we'll get more supporters. But first we need a new target. I hope we can find a good one. Beep, 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 beep. Uh, I have some new info. Apparently there's a group of burglars terrorizing Shibuya. From what I hear, they only target restaurants and break in after they close for the day. Someone online was asking if it was the work of the Phantom Thieves. Just reading that got me really irked and stuff. <laughs> we can't let people lump you guys in with petty thieves, right? Uh, but are we the same? Uh, no way. No way. Yeah. You guys are way better than these jerks. Anyway, I heard they've been running away with, uh, without leaving even a trace of evidence. That's all the information. <laughs> information. <laughs> information. <laughs> That's all the information I have on them right now. Sorry. For now, I'll make a post a on the fan site and ask if any. As oh my God. Ask for any more details. People might know. Thank you, <laughs> dude. My head. <laughs> I kind of feel it too. I'm like, I got brain rot. <laughs> Man, being famous really brings its own unique set of problems. But we don't really have any info. We'll just have to wait for Mishme to get a more solid lead. Why don't we do some, uh... Oh, we got messages. Oh my god, who's spamming me? So many people. Oh, let's do it. Yeah, let's go to no! work. But anyway, you guys will have to wait till the next episode to see the... Where we will still have dyslexia. <laughs> Yeah, totally. Goodbye. That's it. Yeah, goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> no outro for you. <laughs>